Samsung Galaxy Watch 4 and Watch 4 Classic were launched side by side and one of the most common questions I get is what is the difference between the two and I'm going to give you a straight answer right now. There isn't any actual difference between the two watches at least when it comes to specs. The main difference between the two watches is in the build. The Watch 4 is available in the 40 and 44mm variant whereas the Watch 4 Classic is available in the 42 and 46mm variants. There is quite a bit of difference in weight and dimensions of the watch as you can see on your screen right now. Another and probably the biggest difference between the two watches is the rotating bezel. The Watch 4 comes with a touch sensitive bezel whereas the Watch 4 Classic has a physical rotating bezel. Watch 4 is the successor of the Watch Active 2 and the Watch 4 Classic is more inspired by the Watch 3 Classic. Despite the different dimensions, both watches share the same screen size. Still, Watch 4 Classic models are 2mm bigger due to physical bezels. By the way, I have compared Watch 4 and Active 2 on this channel, so feel free to check it out. You will find that Active Watch 2 still holds up. Some users are die-hard fans of the physical rotating bezel. However, they will be disappointed to know Samsung will be doing away with the classic lineup in the next-gen Galaxy Watch 5 series. In terms of the looks, I personally find the Galaxy Watch 4 to be more impressive looking overall. It has a sleek and sporty look. However, some of my friends have suggested that I have bad taste when it comes to watches and they like the classic 4 more. Beauty can be subjective, so which one do you like better? Do tell me in the comment section down below. In the health and sports tracking department, one is not better than the other. You can check out our Samsung Galaxy Watch 4 review to find out how well the watch works in the day-to-day -day usage. To tell you quickly, I would say that the Watch 4 has got the basics like heart rate tracking right, but fails in some departments like sleep tracking. Similarly, the Watch 4 running accuracy was less than stellar compared to the Garmin 245 Music. Since both watches share the same Samsung Bioactive sensor, you get the same performance on both the watches. It is pretty good overall compared to previous generation watches. You have an option to buy the LT variant of both the Samsung Galaxy Watch 4 and the Watch 4 Classic as well. Unless you really need it, I won't recommend going with the LT version given the battery life of the watch. Despite the different dimensions, the battery life on both the watches is more and less the same. If you happen to own one of both models, you can check out some battery life saving tips for Watch 4 using the I button. So apart from physical differences, there isn't any major distinction between the two watches. I would recommend going with the watch that you like more or you feel comfortable with the most. If those two factors don't matter to you and you want to save money, go with the Watch 4. At the time of making this video, you will save more than $100 if you go with the Watch 4. So which one are you going to buy? Tell us in the comment section down below. With that, it's time to say goodbye. But before you go, consider subscribing to our channel for more videos like this. See you next time.